Dyer, we're going to talk about what we call social emotional intelligence. I think it's a, a thing, a corner phrase, but what we are missing is really our well being. And that's really what the whole thing is. So I'm going to put social social emotional intelligence is a word that we use to if someone says they understand something but what's social emotional I, I mentioned this before because I love talking about the brain right and we have different parts of the brain as you know the part of the brain that we must I really say we must understand when it comes to social emotional is how things come into the brain right so we know we have, we have our sight we have our hearing we have our smell we have our taste we have our touch what else are we missing when it comes to social emotional what else are we missing what we're missing is besides our five senses is actually how we connect through our vibration. Now remember this is the brain. And in the brain right around here, right? We have the hippocampus. And as things come in into this pleasure center of the brain, and then we have our spinal cord, and then we know this is the brain stem. Just taking this, how things are coming into our lives, it affects our well being, it affects who we are. Now we know there's different things that affect us as we know the exterior stuff is uh, sleep, um, people, really it comes down to our environment. Our environmental factors, right? All things outside of us. So that's environmental factors, all things outside of us. But then we translate it, we transpose it into our bodies how we feel about it, how it triggers the pleasure center, how it triggers the different endorphins, how it triggers the different neurons in our brains and in our bodies, which sends the signal down to our organs, right? We have the stomach, heart, liver, spleen, and then we have this great thing of this vagus nerve that runs through our whole body. Now we have seven million nerves in our body, seven million. With all that seven million nerves that's in our body, all those seven million nerves, it gets I'll write this better so you can see it, but we get it gets a message. The message comes from here. What is that message saying? That message is affected, that we know it's affected by trauma or anything unhappy. We use the word, people have been using the word trauma and trauma this. It could just mean that you're unhappy. And it doesn't even matter why you're unhappy. It doesn't even, I, I'm not saying your unhappiness doesn't matter, but what matters most is how you're relating to it inside your body. And that is, to me, that's an understanding
that gets missed. Not that I'm feeling something, but why am I feeling it? Not the cause of the feeling, but why does the cause create the feeling? Until you understand that, this is just social emotional. The intelligence part comes with understanding what's causing it. If I broke my foot because I fell, what caused my foot to break? Is it the fall or is it how I fell or is it the impact on the ground of another hard surface with my body weight and the angle which caused the break? Those are not all the same. All the same means that you are doing something that has created something that has made something happen. Right? That's social emotion. The intelligence is understanding it. We have more to talk about and we need to get more into this, but I did just want to do this just so you can get like a little small piece of what social emotion was because the intelligence part can go into different avenues of how to manipulate yourself, how to manipulate others. But if you don't understand, it's hard for you to ever do anything. Thank you, I'm Dr. Paul Dyer.